In this video I'm going to show you how to uh, edit a uh, Zoo template. So we uh, will head to Zoo, which we've installed for Joomla. And uh, we have already set up uh, a couple of directories in Zoo. Now let's head into Settings. We have created these directories using the Cookbook app, so that's where we're heading now. And here is the, um, the the details. So in here, we can click to Event Service Listing to see the, the various fields that are available. And we can add extra fields if we want for the, uh, for the directory. So for example, we've got the logo field that takes images. We've got the city field that's just a text field. We can edit any of these if we want. Now we want to look at uh, the, the layout of it on the website. So we use the default area here. The teaser is the short introduction that's shown on the, the category page. So here at the moment there's a name, logo, short description. And we can add additional fields by simply dragging and dropping them. So maybe we want to add the street address to the description. Maybe we don't want to add it there. You can add the mod modification date perhaps to the, the info bar. And you can choose whether or not to show a label. In other words, date for example or last edited. Save and close. So that's the, the teaser which is a short preview on the category page. And full is the full item listing. And here again it works the same way. You can drag and drop across the various things that you want into the fields that are available and rearrange them as you want. So phone could go below the street address or vice versa. And when you're happy you simply save and close. So that's an introduction to um, the Zoo templates and how it works uh, in the Joomla system. This is for Joomla 2.5 and for Joomla 3.x.